customer gave us a call. Their septic tank was backing up. They had called a plumber out to clear the line, but he highly recommended they pump out the septic tank. Popped open the riser on the inlet side. You can see that thick crust built up on top. Moved over to the outlet side. You can see that crust over here as well. I'm going to start pumping down the inlet side first. It looked like there was some corn left over from dinner last night. To help break up all that toilet paper that was floating on top, I'm going to bring in the crust buster and mix up a poop smoothie. Mmm! Puzza di denaro! After I mixed up the tank into a poop whirlpool, I took a look inside to see if it had two chambers, and it is only one chamber because I can see the crust buster and my stinger on that side. Even though this tank is just a single compartment, I'd still recommend popping open the outlet side and pumping out from there as well, that way you don't leave big chunks left behind. And once I get to the bottom of the tank, I'm going to rinse it off. It doesn't have to be perfect, it is a shit tank after all, and nobody's going to be eating off the bottom. I just want to make it nice and clean, that way I can take a picture and show the customer that we did a throw job. And after that, this customer should be good to go for the next 3-5 to five years.